do you have um, an experience at times? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Do you have an experience at times of feeling like like you're in the groove, like you're in perfect alignment? Like there are, are there moments where I, I never look for that. But there are times in which I experience like like absolute love for my friend here. I, I, that I can experience. Um, I have children and grandchildren of which I do the cleaning because I want to make sure that I'm not attached to them in any, any way so that they can get the information directly from the, from the divinity, not from me. So I'm just cut, 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 cut all the time and occasionally I, when I get a call from my, my, my children, my two I have two daughters, 30 plus, um, I can feel love for them. Yeah. When you say cut, are you talking about cutting apricots? Yeah, cut, I'm talking about erasing memories in me that I experience them as quotes, judging them, how come they don't do this way, they don't do that, and all that. Yeah. And they're beautiful, my children are. Um, are beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. But my responsibility for them is to is to set them free from any grasp that I have on them, which is memory, like trying to grab them. Would uh, that include f loving memories? A memory is a memory. So? It's a dead memory. There's no such thing as, as a, a good memory. So to set them free from memories would be not to remember any of the past that you've ever had together? Or to, to at some point, to see them as gods. Now you say, or. Yeah. Be, they're mutually exclusive. Oh, of course, because if I, if I have, if I have, and you know, I, I'm going to be cleaning with them to, to the day I die. It's just the way it is. I mean, they're there, I experience them, and I want to make sure I'm just cutting these ties so that they get the information directly from the divinity, not from me. Mm -hmm. So, am I sure? Um, I'm never sure. I, I don't know that well. I just keep cleaning and cleaning. You, you speak, or maybe it's Joe, that references the experience of wonder and the importance of the experience of wonder. Could you talk a little more about that? I, I'm, more experience, I'm more interested in the experience of freedom. More yeah. than one. Yeah. yeah. It's interesting because that question brings up, there was a chap, they called himself a chap, yes. in Australia, who, who I was giving, I gave a lecture, and he kept saying, now wait a minute, you mean you don't want us to be curious? That's his comeback. I said, well, to be at, to be at zero, you can be in awe. But if you want to take curiosity instead of, oh, be my guest, yeah. It's hard to, to put things down um, only because um, I, I'm, I'm never certain if I'm inspired or not. And, yes. I, and to, be on, to be very honest, I don't care. I'm just doing the cleaning, just nonstop. Yeah. So I don't have any intentions to for example, um, people will call me. I used to do these things. I don't do anymore. Um, like um, there's a young man in Hawaii who um, he's having a very difficult tr um, quote. Uh, his mother is saying he has very he's having difficult time. People don't like him. He's not doing well at school. And so as I'm reading the email. I'm doing the cleaning. What's going on in me? This is this is showing up. And then she asked um, how to how to help him, and I had to remind her, you're not helping him. It's only about you. What's going on in you that you're experiencing that way? And Do you take individual clients? I, I used to, maybe 20 years ago, but, but I don't no. do that anymore. Yeah. Better that they should learn how to do it on their own, huh? Put us out of business so yeah. we can be vacationing here in Monterey <laughs> instead of trading around the world. I'm curious, um, what in you is uh, creating your commitment to such a rigorous teaching schedule? Somebody asked me that, but they asked me in a different way. This is the way they asked me. 
They asked me, how did you come around, how did you, how did you come around to doing this? And I said, I don't know. Uh, life is a mystery and I just happen to be here in this moment and there are all the forces and I have no idea how these forces brought me here. Uh, but I, I'm clear, I'm clear though, I'm here to clean with you, you chair the board, well, this guy, the camera, and the, <laughs> that thing is going to get on the internet, going to get on, get on shows and the shows are all generated by oil, you know that, right? Your, you have a cell phone? Yes. You, you know what the source, the power of that cell phone is? Oil. Without the oil, that you, you, you guys wouldn't have any. Couldn't generate a cell phone message. It mm -hmm. all goes back, so I'm cleaning with that. The rape of Mother Earth. I know. We're, we're raping Mother Earth, and, but we can't help it. So I'm, I have to remind myself, nobody can help it. Everybody's stuck in programs. And mm -hmm. So somebody's got to get to the cleaning, and I'm willing to do it. Uh, Marvin's willing to do it. More and more people around the world are willing to do it. You have, um, I guess the answer I was looking to to that last question is, I, I had in mind the possibility that you had the hope that many people would be doing this work and that we might change the uh, If nobody showed up, I would do it anyway. But would it not be your hope? Or maybe you don't hope that, uh, don't, that there would be don't you think a movement? That, don't you think it's a form of manipulation? I've thought that. Well, I'm, I can erase that then. <laughs> if, you're, if you're not, I, I can work on that. I, 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 I'm, I want to get to zero uh, so that, that the people who, who are divinely correct to come will come. Right. Uh, that's mine. I'm not, I'm not here to promote anything. I'm not, at least I'm not, I'm not intending to do it. I'm not conscious I'm doing it. I may be, but... I, I think it's a, it's a disservice to people to promote something and then have them come when, when for them divinely it's not correct to, to be wherever they, they end up being, you know. In other words, prom promotion speaks to their memories yeah. and stimulates their memories. Yeah. But can promotion also speak to them as, and, and stir them to want to erase their if, 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 if I clean, let's say I clean in seven, there are eight billion people out there. If I clean and I get myself back to zero, even for an instant, everybody will get back to zero, then it's the divine in them that will, will choose to, to do it or not to do it. Not, not some promotion on my part or some manipulation on my part. Yeah. And the book that Joe wrote about you or with you, yeah. is, is that a manipulation? Is that, how do you see the book? Yeah. Well, it depends on what page you're on. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, depends on what page you're on. Depends Overall, on what, the, how do you feel the, about the, 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 Well, but I cleaned before, so like with you, um, he had asked me, months and months and months if I would do a book with him and I, I, I did the cleaning I heard no, 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 just like with you guys mm -hmm. and at some point I heard yes and so I did it. Now I'm responsible for every point and every letter in the book so there are people who will ask me certain things and uh, have, having not read all of the book myself <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah, so, but I, I, my, my own sense, um, he, he did, I, he, he's a nice guy, mm -hmm. and, and so I, he shows up for me to clean, and I clean, and I heard, do it, and so sometimes somebody will ask me, like you asked me, well, what does Joe Vitale think about it? I said, you'll have to talk to Buddha or do that, I, I can't.